Okay, and we're here behind the scenes at Crescent Center Drugs, and this place is hopping today. I am here with Buddy Jones, and one of the things that I noticed, Buddy, when I first walked in is this thing right here. What is this? This is a robot. They take the uh, bottle, label it, fill it directly, no cross-contamination, accurately. And I bet it's faster, too, isn't it? Uh, yeah, it's a lot faster. You don't have to walk back and grab a drug somewhere or hunt for it. I've got six pharmacists, John and Lee and Ryan and Greta and me and then my father. And I, let's see, Daddy, you've been practicing how many years? Right at 60. Uh, 60 years. He came out here in the early 70s and then bought the store, and I bought it from him in 93. Betty, what is Lee doing there? He's mixing the powders together, and then he'll put them in a bag, and that will go into capsules. This will separate the capsules. It will make them drop in bottom first. There's 50, and then she'll do 50 more, and then she'll lock it down and pull the tops off. And then uh, all the powder will go on there, and then she will spread it around and pack it into the capsules. And there's a lot of technique to it, but then a lot of it is your equipment. This is actually is a poison ivy lotion. Uh, it's got a little bit of everything in it. These are different creams uh, for inflammation. Uh, so you can tell we've put it in, packed it in there and sealed the tube. Uh, this is a uh, lollipop. Uh, we use it a lot after uh, patients have had uh, tonsils taken out. This is a sterile product we've made under our sterile hood. These are two different suppositories. This is a regular suppository. You really can't I'll open it up one and show you. This is a regular suppository. This one is uh, called a rectal rocket. And I want to open this up and show it to you. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's hysterical. <laughs> this one. Uh, it's actually made to go very deep, and it also has a tapered tip for the outside, and it has a uh, slit down the middle uh, that has two, two uh, functions. One is it makes it easier to pop out of the mold, and then also if, uh, if you have any gas, you don't eject the suppository. Well, Betty, we really didn't want to go that far behind the scenes. <laughs> <laughs> well, my father probably learned how to make uh, a lot of these compounds and then they went away from it and now he's we're back doing it again. Okay, well thank you for having us. We've had a good time as well as learned a lot. Oh, good.